Hi everybody, Joe for jazbeescasebreaks.com. Happy Sunday. Coming at you with 2022 Panini Contenders Optic Football 10 box half case. Pick your team number four. It's from a fresh case because it filled before number three. And big thanks to Andrew. Andrew was like, man, was got impatient, was tired of waiting. Knocks this break out on a Sunday. Good luck to you. Good luck to everybody. Good luck. That's right, Justin. She might be a keeper, but you're the beekeeper. All right, there's the contender's optic. Half case from a fresh case. So, on this side, we've got 10 boxes right there, 10 boxes right here. So, we're going to roll the die. We're going to go 1, 2, 3 for the left side, 4, 5, 6 for the right side using this die. And it's 2, 1, 2. This side, we will say for pick your team 3, which is sold out, but all we need to do is a filler. We just need to knock out that filler and give away the remaining teams. There you go, Boston Bruins scoring a goal to tie up the game, I think. There it is. Yep, they tied it 2-2, beginning of the third period. All right, we're looking for two autographs per box on average. Good luck, everybody. Got Kyle Hamilton blue. That's to 99. That's for Aaron and the Ravens. Optic Illusion Bar Saquon Barkley and uh, Tyreek Hill. All right. And your autos. Good luck. First one is going to be Tyrion Davis Price. Rookie ticket on card autograph for Andrew and the Niners. And the next one is 30 out of 75, Brian Robinson Jr. Nice looking blue parallel there for Ryan Harold and the Commanders. Tyron Davis Price, a uh, LSU guy. Go Tigers, says Justin. All right, Terry McLaurin. Damian Pierce to 175 for Houston. That's going to be Steve Locke and Jamar Chase to 99. That'll be for Cincinnati. That's going to go to Tom. Once again, Steve gets the, uh, the Pierce. All right, and your autos. Jeremy Rucker, 37 out of 75. Rookie ticket autograph for the Jets. It'll be for Tyler O. And 68 out of 75, Jamison Williams. You gotta know when to hold them. Know when to fold them. 
Know when to walk away. Know when to run. Andrew with the Lions. There's Brian Robinson Jr. Ah, Tyron Davis Price. The bruiser became a true LSU favorite when he ran for 253 against Florida. Have, have the Niners really used him that much? I feel like I've not, not seen his name too often. Although the running back position's a little weird. You guys might have guided in the league for years and then I'll just blow up for a season or two. You never know. Mm, looks like we got some points there. So points will randomize to, not a lot of points, too. We'll randomize to one person in the break. Winner take all of the points if there's any more. All right, there's still Packers, Aaron Rodgers, there's Mahomes, and there's Malik Willis, two out of 10. Unfortunately, Malik Willis stock might be going down with the, uh, you know, with the recent drafting of, uh, of uh, Will Levis, right? All right, the autograph is John Mechie III, 69 out of 75. I'm not sure what his status is going to be going into this season. That's for uh, Steve Locke and the Texans. Will he be healthy? You know, some battling some things. Leukemia? Non-Hodgkin's something? Forget, some sort of cancer. Not the super scary, so I mean all cancer is scary, but not, but a treatable one I want to say. But still having to, to get work on that. Justin would like to see Malik as a backup if you were the Ravens. Yeah, I wonder if Malik Willis is now, is now going to be on the trade market. And if he does end up with, as a backup somewhere with potential starting status, that might reboost his value in the hobby. 86 out of 99, Alvin Kamara and Kenneth Walker third. Alvin Kamara going to the Saints. That'll be for Ed P. Can the Saints get a QB too? We got Brian Cook, 18 out of 75. Rookie ticket autograph for the Chiefs, Sam. I actually think the Saints got that... Uh, Got another Fresno State quarterback, Derek Carr from Fresno State, and then they got, um, and then they got uh, what's gonna call it? They got the Jeff Hayner or something like that from Fresno State. Are these case hits? Seahawks. That goes to Andrew. The legitness. Nice. It's pretty cool. I dig it. All right, and the RPA is Jahan Dotson, rookie patch autograph, going to Ryan Harold and the Commanders. Twenty out of sixty on that one. New cases this year. Oh, yeah, I see it right there. I dig it. That looks cool. There's Aaron Jones Atomic to 2020, or uh, <laughs> tops, uh, Cracked Ice for the Packers. That'll be for Keith. Cooper Cup will go to the Rams. That'll be for Michael. And behind Chris Olave is, is Jelani Woods for the Blue Horseshoes. It's Anthony, Anthony Richardson, right, for the Colts? Is he a week one starter? The Bruins score. Now, now they're up 3-2 on the Panthers. Game seven. A lot of time left, though. 15-50 left in the third period. Behind Olave is Drake London. London, London, London. That goes to Andrew and the Atlanta Falcons. Wow. 
What a goal. All right. Halfway through this half case break. Second half is in the store. We just need to do that filler. So let's knock that out, ladies and gentlemen. We'll run the other half back. All right, there's DK Metcalf Refractor, Joe Burrow Lottery Ticket, and Ezekiel Elliott. And we got Tyler Algier, 21 out of 99. Rookie ticket autograph for Andrew and the Falcons, the Dirty Birds, the ATL. I like that, that teal parallel, that really pops. And we got Jalen Tolbert. Dallas Cowboys. Ed P with Dallas. Nice little heartwarming story for the Dallas Cowboys over the draft weekend. I think one of their main scouts uh, was uh, drafted by his uh, was drafted by the Cowboys. One of the scouts for the Cowboys got to put in the call for the pick, which was like a late round pick, and then they usually don't. You know, call guys or do stuff like that, but he got to call his son, which I thought was pretty cool. I think it was unexpected. He didn't know. All right, Ezekiel Elliott, Tyquan Thornton to 50, and we got Tom Brady, a Tom Brady die cut for the Buccaneers. That'll be for Andrew and the Bucks. Tyquan Thornton goes to Walter and the Patriots. And then we've got Sam Williams, 72 out of 75 for the Dallas Cowboys. Another one for Ed. And behind Vellis Jones Jr. is Garrett Wilson, 107 out of 149. Rookie ticket autograph for the Jets. That's going to be for Tyler. Your offensive rookie of the year, and he's got Brett Favre throwing the ball to him now. That's got to help. I mean, if he could win offensive rookie of the year with a subpar quarterback, subpar quarterbacking in total, but Justin's wondering if anybody from the NFC South will finish above 500. Hmm. You got to think uh, the Saints, no? Saints definitely made a made a upgrade with uh, in the quarterback position, and they're in a weak, you know, they're in a weak uh, division. So if they could beat up on their their divisional opponents, and win a couple other games here and there. Probably good for above 500 for a nine win season. There's Tyler Algier, 82 out of 99. And there's Max Crosby to 99. Raiders picking up a lot of defensive help in the draft. Max Crosby should get a little help as well, which is good. It'll be good for everybody. Andrew with my Raiders. Also has the Falcons as well. All right, beyond Brock Purdy's Fred Taylor, 32 out of 50. Old Jaguar legend Fred Taylor. That will be for Ed P. And behind Brock Purdy is Sam Howell. I mean, after post draft, I think Sam Howell's stock should either be the same or, or actually go up a little bit. I don't think the Commanders got a quarterback. There you go, Ryan Harold with the Commanders. Which makes it sound like they're going to give him every chance to uh, to win the job outright and lead the team this season. And here's Brock Purdy for the Niners. That's going to go to Andrew. All right. Two boxes to go. Oliver, what's going on? My condolences to your Sacramento Kings. Did I say Brett Favre? 
Just making sure you're paying attention, Mike Tower. Just making sure you were paying attention. I meant Aaron Rodgers. Brett Favre, that would, that would be kind of crazy. It's either Brett Favre came out of retirement, here's Mahomes to 99, or Garrett Wilson went back in time. Chiefs, that's for uh, Sam, and this Daniel Jones to 99 is for Andrew. Just making sure you're paying attention, Ryan. Or uh, Mike, I can't even get your name right. There's Danny Gray, Niners. That'll be for Andrew. Hmm. Yeah, Oliver's going to need a few days to let that game go. There's Romeo Dobbs, 56 out of 75, Rookie of the Year contender. And that will be for the, the Packers. It's for Keith. All right, last box. That's part of the settlement for his case. Imagine. Although that's not this year. That's not not a not the death sentence that it would have been in years past, Mike. Jets are looking pretty good. I'm looking forward to seeing some of the official win totals start to start to pop up for these NFL teams. Some official win totals as we get closer to the season. All right, we got Tyler Algier, 11 out of 22, cracked ice autograph for Andrew and the Falcons. And the final autograph coming up, it's going to be Danny Gray for the Niners, another one for Andrew. And there you go, ladies and gentlemen, that is the break. The next half in the store right now. We just need to do that filler. JaspiesCaseBreaks.com. And let's see who's going to get the 900 points. So let's flip back to the main list, the list. Let's get everybody's names 1 through 32. New dice, new list. And person on top after 10. 6 and a 4, 10 times we'll get those 900 points, which is a pretty substantial amount of points. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5. Six and a four, seven, eight, nine, and good luck. Tenth and final time after ten. Yeah, Andrew definitely had the odds on his side. One of his last spot mojo spots helping him out. 900 points going your way, Andrew. And there you go, gang. I'm Joe for jazbeescasebreaks.com. I'll see you next time for the next one. Bye bye.